Hello there everyone, welcome to Chishap channel Guys, previously I vlog how I made restyle my home slipper So now I'm going to restyle again this slipper that I used for going out This for going out, so it's already old I restyled this one before but I'm going to restyle again this time because it's already old as you can see it's already old and I'm going to remove all of this and replace a new one and using this yarn yarn a multicolor yarn yellow like blue and purple so guys with the use of this scissor no need a needle so only the scissor and a yarn and my old my old slipper so guys without further ado let's begin please subscribe my youtube channel please subscribe my
moves like sprung. Sing along to Elton John to that feeling we're just getting started. needle using this nylon thread to sew it with my slipper here I'm going to sew it here so later I'll show you but first I'm going to thread my huge needle using this nylon thread just to insert the yarn in this hole of my needle so this is it guys and voila it's ready to sew my slipper first I'm going to lock it at the end using this knot So it's done covering the strap of the slipper and now I'm going to proceed to make style using a pom-pom, not yet finished. So I'm going to make a pom-pom out of this yarn. I'm going to teach you guys on how to make it. Like this. Okay, I'm going to put it here. This, uh, this, one, this one has a ugly part so I'm going to cover it using pom-pom. This one here. So I'll show you guys on how to make a pom-pom out of this yarn. I'm going to roll it to 12 rolls and tie it. I will show you guys on how to make uh, yarn pom poms for my decorations for my style of my slipper. So I roll it 12 rolls on my two fingers and tie it at the middle. Tie a string at the middle or at the center of this rolled yarn. Tie it firmly. And cut the edges of the yarn that has curved like this one and spread it so we have to spread it first like this and cut evenly like round shape make sure that so now i have to cut the edges or the excess of this yarn to shape it circular or round round shape so i have to flip it every side so that i will achieve the round shape and later on i'll comb it using this comb to burst the edges to make it floppier every size and again cut those excess and shape it a round shape so this one.
So I'm done restyling my old slipper using yarn and with pom poms design. So guys, what can you say about this slipper now? You can comment down below if you want to. Thank you so much. Thank you.